we finally have our first real look at the new tri-fold phone. The one that doesn't just fold once, but twice and opens up into a full tablet. And yeah, they only showed it behind glass. No touching, no hands-on, just observe it in its natural habitat, like a rare animal at the zoo. But even from that, we actually learned a lot. So here's what's happening. This thing folds in a G shape, with a normal everyday cover display on the outside, so you can just use it like a regular phone. But then you unfold it once, and again, and suddenly, you're holding a 10 inch tablet. A real one, not a stretched phone screen, a tablet that fits in your pocket. The bezels are definitely thicker than what we're used to on top-end foldables, so that's noticeable, but the overall hardware? Surprisingly clean. Each panel is thin, and when it's closed, it's about the thickness of a phone with a case on it, so not the brick people were scared of. Yes, there are creases, technically too, but if you've used the foldable before, you already know the deal. You notice it when you look for it. You forget it exists when you use the device. The more interesting part is durability. The fragile folding glass stays inside, protected. The outer screen uses hardened glass like a standard phone. So this should be much more practical day to day than earlier trifold concepts. Camera system? It looks similar to what today's flagship foldables use. Main lens, ultra wide, telephoto. There were rumors of extreme zoom, but visually, yeah, no. Expect solid quality, just not space telescope levels. Inside, you're looking at a top tier chip, big RAM, big storage options. Battery isn't confirmed yet, but realistically, around 5,500 milliamp hours makes sense. Now, availability. This is not a mass market device yet. Production numbers are small, launch regions are limited. So if you want one, you'll probably need to import it. And that means dealing with shipping, availability, and possibly tariffs. And considering the price is expected to land around premium laptop money, you've gotta really want it. But here's the bigger picture. This is the first trifold that feels like it's actually ready. Not a prototype, not a proof of concept, a device. It's thin, it's functional, it behaves like a phone when closed and like a tablet when open. This is the direction foldables have been trying to go for years. More screen when you need it, less when you don't. This isn't just a new phone, it's the next step. If this kind of tech evolution interests you, stick around, we've got a lot more to talk about.